What up, everybody? It's your boy as Apocalypse. Welcome to the channel, subscribers and viewers. Today, we got SML movie Jeffy Sleepover by Super Luigi Logan. This just dropped not too long ago. I'm excited. I'm also excited because your boy turned 20 years old in nine days. You know, but <laughs> I'm super shit. Nah, but um, without any further delay, man, let's get right into it. Let's go. Today, we're gonna be I'm learning done. anatomy of the eye. So first off, we have the sclera. It's the white part of your eye. And then, we have the pupil. The pupil is the black part of the eye. And then, we have the so iris. Say, the iris is the color part of the eye. My iris is brown. It might be really hard to see, because I'm so Asian, and my um, eyes are so slant. Any questions, class? Oh, teacher, I got a question. Ah, yes, you, dumb shit. What's your question? What would happen if someone took a fork and shoved it in your eye? Ah, yes. If you were to take fork and shove it in your eye, it would hurt really, really bad. But you have two eyes for a reason. All right, class. Now let's move oh, on to how dude. we can use our eyes as a coin slot. Wait, what color are my eyes, Cody? Uh, black. Racist? No, Junior, your eyes are just black. You don't have <laughs> Cody, I'm already being racist all the time. <laughs> Wait, Cody, what, what color are your eyes? Uh, hold on, let me take off my glasses. Ugh, boom, eyes of an angel. Uh, Cody, you don't have an eye color. Yeah, I know. What color is Ken's eyes? Uh, blue, which is also what he did to me last night. What, he blew you? <laughs> yeah, yeah, he did. And uh, speaking of blowing me, I'm having a sleepover tonight. You want to come? A sleepover? Look at Jeffy, yeah, yo. <laughs> my yeah. nigga. I don't like your parents, Cody. They're weird. Well, <laughs> that's the thing, Junior. My parents aren't even going to be there. It's just going to be me and Ken. All alone. Yo. We need a third wheel for our tricycle so we can get <laughs> Look at Jeffy. I don't know, Cody. I don't, I don't really like sleepovers at your house. <laughs> okay, picture this, Junior. Me, up to my neck in whipped cream, and you have to find the cherry. You I do nasty. like cherries. Yeah. Come well, on, like bro. Sleepover? sleepover? I want to have a sleepover. Mm, sorry, Jeffy. I was hoping it would just be me, Junior, and Ken. You know, four's a crowd, three's loud. Just have a menage a trois. I guess I'll go, Cody. Really? Oh my god, I, I didn't think you would say yes. We have to get ready, Ken. Come on. Hey, Donnie. Hey, Jeffy. How was school? It was gay. I'd rather really staple my ball sack to my leg than go back to school. Don't say that, Jeffy. Daddy, can I have a sleepover? A sleepover? Yeah. With yeah, what? I don't friends? Have a I'm friends. Name one. Um. Uh, you. I'm not your friend, <laughs> Jeffy. <laughs> fine, fine, Jeffy. F fine, Jeffy. Fine, Jeffy. <laughs> Jeffy, fine. Fine, Jeffy. We're friends. We're friends. We're friends, Jeffy. But look, look, I'm your dad, so it doesn't really count. Like, I'm talking about a real friend. Look, if you can get one friend oh, to come man. over and have a sleepover with you tonight, then I'll let you have a sleepover, okay? All right, Donnie. I just need one friend to have a sleepover with me. Where am I gonna find a friend? Draw some money. Oh, I know. I know somebody who will always answer. Bruh, no. 911, what's your emergency? Girl, I thought I told you to get dinner ready. Yeah. Oh my god, that sounds like a crime. Uh, I'll be right over there, ma'am. Hello? Hey there. I'm responding to a domestic disturbance call I got a little while ago, and uh, I'm here to join in. You know, throw some punches? I, I'm kidding. I'm actually just here to arrest some people. Oh. Bro. Well, that was just me. That was you? Yeah. Wow, that's pretty impressive, actually. I, I thought oh, someone was really man. beating their wife. <laughs> Dawn. Alright, so yeah, that domestic disturbance call we got was a false alarm. Over. Uh, sorry about the walkie-talkie. They make me carry this thing everywhere to let them know what's going on, but no more prank calls, okay? Okay, I just really wanted to have a sleepover. So can you? Ooh, a sleepover, huh? That sounds like fun, but sorry, kid, I can't. Crime never sleeps. All units, all units, please respond. We got a shooting at a gas station. Oh, man. Right at the good part, yo. You gonna give me this advertisement, dog? Really, man? Ah, uh, yo, damn man, Brooklyn said no. Sorry, Jeffy. Three, two, one. Bro. All units, all units, please respond. We got a shooting at a gas station. 
Oh, oh shit. shit. Oh my god, it shots fired at a gas station? Done. Oh, hold on, kid. All right, I'll be right over. I'm, I'm bringing backup, okay? All right, so how about that sleepover, huh? <laughs> okay. right. Hey, Danny. I found a friend for the sleepover. Oh, you did? Who is it? Hey there. What? You can't say you've been beating on him. You think that's funny, huh? What if I started beating on you? Well, what's going on? <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just here for a sleepover. What? Jeffy, you cannot invite a cop to a sleepover. Uh, hey, Daddy, he's my friend. He's not your friend, Jeffy. Whoa, 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 whoa. Are, are you saying cops aren't friendly? Are, are you saying I'm a dirty cop? Because I'm not a dirty cop. I took a shower this morning. No, I'm Bruh. not saying you're a dirty cop. I'm just saying, Jeffy, you can't invite a cop to a sleepover because he's busy. He has a job. Like, like, don't you have duty? Uh, no, I already went. And I, I went pee-pee, too. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's, a, that's a cop poop joke. You should appreciate Stop that. It, dude. Jeffy, Stop. Look, he's Stop. a really busy man, and he has, like, donuts to eat or something. Oh, well, don't you have ravioli or something to eat, fat? <sighs> Fine, Jeffy. If you want to have a sleepover with him, y'all can have a sleepover. But what are you going to do in your stupid sleepover? Pillow fight! Oh, pillow fight! Oh. 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 Hell yeah! Oh. 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 You guys are only hitting me. How about you hit each other? Uh, okay, yeah, bring it on, tough guy. <laughs> oh. Officer Guy, where, where the hell are you? We're getting massacred out here. Please respond. Uh, 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 officer down. Uh, ouch. Uh. I'm the pillow fight champion of the world! Alright, Jeffy, you had your stupid pillow fight. Now, what do you want to do during the sleepover? Why scary, are you so worried? Stories. Scary stories? I don't know any scary stories. Do you know Bruh. any scary stories? Oh, yeah, I got a really good one. Oh, my okay. God. So, this one time, I was buying Cheez Its from a vending machine, right? Uh -huh. So, I walk up to the machine. I put my $1 Yo, bill in. Animation. And I push B2, because that's the button for Cheez Its. And I love it. Cheez Its. And I'm thinking it's gonna be a good day. I'm gonna enjoy this bag of Cheez Its. And then Brooklyn. the machine starts moving. Come on, it starts Brooklyn. making noise. This is gonna be amazing, right? And then the machine, it's pushing those Cheez Its toward me, and I'm like, yes, come to Papa. Come to Papa. And right as it's about to drop, it gets stuck. Wait, well, it gets stuck? It gets stuck. The Cheez Its get stuck right between the glass <laughs> and the shelf. And they're not dropping, they're not moving, and my mouth goes, because I just can't believe this. So I start pounding on start shaking the machine and then I remember if the machine falls on you you can die so I yeah it'll, it'll crush you yeah it will so I stop shaking the machine <laughs> and then I go and I ask my buddy Joe for some money right and I've already asked him for money tons of times and he says guy I can't give you any more money I you already owe me like 300 bucks I say Joe it's just a bag of Cheez-Its you know what I'm talking about right just a bag of Cheez-Its yeah, it's like a dollar right yeah exactly it's just a dollar so he says fine and he gives me a dollar in quarters Okay, and I'm thinking, yes, this is perfect. I needed exactly a dollar. I'm going to go back to that machine. So I walk up to the machine, and I put each of those quarters into the machine. And I'm thinking, this is going to be amazing. And then, oh, much to my surprise, the coins just drop, and they fall right into the change return slot. And I'm thinking, what's going on? And then I notice, I notice the machine is broken. It doesn't even have an out of order sign on it. Bruh. The change is just dropping right down. It's not even accepting coins. No, it's just accepting bills. That's right. So I don't Come have any bills. Man. I can't this is dragged out money now, so, yeah. so I'm ready to give up, right? Now I'm just walking away. And then all of a sudden, I see behind me, this kid comes up to the machine, and then he puts his dollar in, and he gets two bags of Cheez-Its. What, he hit B2? He hit B2, and he gets two bags of Cheez-Its. His bag of Cheez-Its, and my bag of Cheez-Its that I paid for. Well, what would the kid do? Uh, the kid, I walk back over to the kid, right? And I say, hey, kid... That's my bag of Cheez-Its. And he says, no, no, it's not. I paid for this. And I said, I, 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 I don't think you understand. You see. Oh, my God, yo. This is not. <laughs> this is not scary dairy at all, yo. <laughs> so, this nigga had a nightmare for a bag of Cheez-Its. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, three, two, one, go. Said, I, I don't think you understand. You see, you paid for your bag of Cheez-Its, and you got my bag of Cheez-Its free because I already put my money in, and it didn't give it to me. Exactly. And he's not buying it, he doesn't care, right? And he's saying, you're just a grumpy old man, go away. So yeah. I lose my temper a little bit, and I start putting my hands on the kid. You know, I, I think you understand where I'm coming from, right? I'm just like, I'm grabbing the kid, and I, I'm strangling him just a little bit, to be honest. 
And then his mom comes around the corner oh, and she sees this, right? Shit. And she freaks out. She thinks I'm just some crazy cop abusing my power. So, then I have to explain to this woman, listen, you stupid punk kid stole my bag of cheeses. Well, it's not his, they were yours. Exactly. 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 And I'm trying to tell her that, but she's not buying it. She's just thinking I'm crazy and she's not listening to anything I'm saying, right? So she decides, she decides to call my boss. What are your boss? My boss. And so she's Why you look like one that? of your officers here is harassing my son and trying to steal cheese its from him. And so I snatch the phone away from her and I say, Chief, you know me. You know how, how much I love my Cheez Its. Pl please tell this crazy bitch and her kid that I'm just trying to get my Cheez Its. And he says, Guy, just leave it alone. Guy, just, just, just forget it. And I say, No. I say, No, Chief, I can't forget it. It's not even about the guy getting <laughs> Cheez Its anymore. It's about the principle of the matter. It's about the fact that this kid owes me something and he's not giving it to me. And he says, Guy, just leave right now or you're fired. So I hang up on him. And then I Yo. start to smell just a little, just a little whiff of weed on the mom, just, just a little bit. And then, and then, and then I start arresting the mom. And so then the kid goes into foster care. And guess who gets two bags of Cheez-Its? Who? I get two bags of Cheez-Its. Two delicious bags of Cheez-Its. And what's? It's, it's delicious, right? So I go back to my car. And I go back in, and I, I, I sit in there, and I turn on some Bon Jovi, and I'm, I'm singing while I'm eating the Cheez-Its. I'm singing, oh, we're halfway there. No. No, 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 living on a prayer. I'm, just, I'm chugging these Cheez-Its, right? I'm just downing them. I'm pouring them right down my throat, just, ah, like a oh, dinosaur. Man. I'm getting crumbs in my mustache and the seat, and I don't even care. This is and an man, exaggerated an sleepover, bro. The entire, <laughs> the entire bag? The entire bag. I get bag. what they do. And I them. start getting sad. And then I remember, I don't have to be. Said. You know why? Why? Because I got another bag of Cheez Its. So I squeeze it. I squeeze it as hard as I can until that bag pops open. And then I just, uh, just pour them right down my mouth. I just start chugging those cheesy chips. It is delicious. And I'm loving it. And to that day, to this day, that was the best bag of Cheez Its I have ever had. That's fucked up because I, I had Cheez Its before an extra dollar I started recording. Me, just in case. So yeah, that's the scariest story I know. And I know what you're thinking. I mean, how is a story about cheese? It's scary, but you know, you never know what life's gonna give you. One minute you get no bags of cheese, it's next minute you get two bags of cheese. It's you're in foster care and your mom's in jail. You just never know. And you never want to get between a cop and his cheese. It's you know what I mean? <laughs> wow, what a crappy sleepover. So what am I gonna do tonight? Let's see. Uh, you guys still there? Good. Guys? Well. I mm. guess I'm off duty. Uh, whatever. What is your favorite type of chips? I gotta go with Brooklyn and say cheeses. Hey guys, it's Logan. I hope you enjoyed watching the video. I want to say thank you to Nick Tendo. He's the YouTuber who made that six minute animation you just hey. watched. And I can't believe he made short notice. He's really amazing. Go check out his channel. Go subscribe to him. Go, go, go show my boy some love because he's amazing and he always shows up for me. And I just can't believe he made it on such a short notice. And it, it was an amazing animation. And this video would have been kind of lame without the animation because it would have been Broken Guy talking for six minutes. And I'm sorry the video kind of felt a little rushed, but I had to go out of town so I need something quick okay. and the video turned out really funny to me I, I love the animation and the story with broken guy but I promise guys uh, starting uh, the next video it'll be better 10 minute videos everything will be good um, but I love you guys I'll see you in the next video and to the SML question hit that like button hit that subscribe button and keep watching I love you guys and I'll see you in the next video I think I'm about to start doing 10 minute videos I ain't gonna go flex because it just seems like the content, it gets you more into it the longer it is. But like... <clears throat> I can't believe this whole time. He was like, it's not even about the Jesus no more. It's the principle. <laughs> the principles for a bag of cheeses, bruh. I, I gotta... I gotta make a big deal of a Jesus next time I'm at a vending machine. I ain't even gonna fuck. But, um. This is awesome. This is pretty awesome. I wonder what the fuck happened with Junior and Cody. I, I wonder what happened. Then again, I don't wanna know. Scratch that. I don't wanna know. Y'all subscribe to Super Luigi Logan. Link in the description along with the original video. 
Also, yo, really quick before I do the rest of my outro, shout out to Nintendo for that animation. Yo, that was dope as fuck, bro. Like, just from my first time seeing one of your animations, no bullshit. You have talent, like, you have a gift. Don't lose that, bro. If you haven't already subscribed to this channel, leave a like if you enjoyed this reaction. Comment below what you thought about this reaction. Deuces. I got a confession, the bullshit ain't never got to me. I just had some fun cause I knew these niggas got tired of me. Call me what you want, all I know is you'll never box with me. You'll never end up on top of me, nobody's stopping me. Ghost. You do not pat man, you do not fuck with the ghost. So much I just wanna say to yourself.